Hey guys, Elvin Mark, you're tuned to the art channel once again and this time we are definitely not outdoors. We are here right at the back of Orchard Road in one of the residences. I have a client who needs a mural done inside the living room and here we are. Welcome. Lots of prep work to be done for this one. You can already see how I've laid out lots of plastic sheets and also to cover up important furniture that I don't want to mess up. Oh, by the way, that took like half the day. So here we go guys, day one. We're in the powder room, but I decided to add those panels in too to give it an immersive effect, you know, when you're walking in. Uh, more on that after I'm done so you get to see the whole entire effect. Let's begin. I must say that it's quite intimidating painting inside someone's living room. You never know when a big mess might accidentally happen. So I had to go a little slower than my usual speed. Coming up with the idea for this piece was very straightforward. It was a memory piece from my client's childhood days growing up in Calcutta. With peacocks parading in the garden with a pond in the middle, she provided a scene and I had to rework some parts of it in Photoshop for approval. And that was pretty much it. What's up people? This is the last day or I'm attempting to make this the last day of this mural. It's all about fine-tuning little dots here and there just to find spots that can be improved on. So there will be a lot of moving back and forth uh, especially when you're working up close. I think this is really important for us who sketch or paint on a small canvas. Uh, it's always good to move far 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 away from the painting every now and then like so 
we get to see the whole picture in its entirety that really helps when we're making art work in a scene especially when I want to get those clouds way back and pushed far back and that mountain over there way back pushed into space on this 2D plane see how this male peacock pops up here so it's really important to keep moving back and forth especially in this piece anything up in front in the foreground of the scene is hammered or punched with a lot of details and especially for this one over here who takes center stage a lot of chroma has been injected into him uh, so that he pops up as opposed to these flowers over here that's really toned down see that it won't fight for attention with this fellow over here and that is a wrap yeah so i hope you enjoyed watching this whole entire process of how i got this from scratch or blank wall to this colored piece here of this garden scene this is elvin mark continue to support me by tuning into my channel and commenting and liking and blah 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 it does really good for the algorithms on this site until the next project or paint out outdoors this is your friendly artist from Singapore. Ciao, ciao.